What is up, FIFA commenters? Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for deciding to watch another video on the channel. If you're new around this corner, you know how it goes. Drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and of course, do let me know if you are enjoying your FIFA experience at the moment. Before we start this play review, we're going to go ahead and open this 85 plus by 10. As you can see on the screen, we get yes, but, but we got very, very solid uh, fodder. I was quite surprised, actually. As you can see right there, we do get a Di Maria. We do get a Sergio Biscuits, who go super cheap on the market right now, but still be very, very decent 85 plus by 10. Now, moving back to the card we have on screen yesterday like i said i wasn't able to do the review of this player but of course i want to do that for you guys today this player of course goes by the full name of carlos enrique venancio casimiro so you notice that uh his uh his his jersey name takes an e but his last name his actual last name takes an i but uh, that's just a detail he is a brazilian international he is born in san jose dos campos in brazil which is a municipality of sao paulo so it would only make sense that he would uh, join the uh, sao paulo uh, FC youth system graduated from the Sao Paulo uh, youth system and uh, you can see him right there next to Lucas Muda which uh, you know it's it's a, it's a cool thing seeing how these players kind of came up together you can also see him here next to Ronaldinho playing against Ronaldinho and his Ronaldinho in his later age there. It's also important to mention that Casemiro uh, was sent on loan to Porto, doing 28 appearances, scoring three goals. See him play against Müller right there uh, against uh, Bayern Munich. The big signing was, of course, Real Madrid uh, in 2013, uh, where he has done a total of 250 plus appearances so far, scoring 24 goals. Of course, under Zidane, under Zinedine Zidane is uh, really where Casemiro really took ownership of that midfield. And of course, he earns the nickname the tank for for a reason. Uh, you see the Bermuda Triangle there, Kroos, Modric, and Casemiro, of course. Now, moving on to the card we see on screen, six foot one, decent height, very decent height for a player who is going to be very much a CDM. Listen, the high to high uh, is something that I noticed, but it's it's something that, it, it's a work week that has always been on his card. This is not something that eSports has modified specifically for this promo. He's always been high high. And I used his rule breaker card and it was okay. It was way, way, way okay. He does, do, he does do run forwards, and the rule breaker, that was a big, big issue because he's so slow that running forward, he would have a lot of issues coming back. But that is solved here with that pace, with the pace increase, with the shooting and the passing. He's right-footed. That is fantastic. Thank you very much, EA Sports, for that. Four-star skill, four-star weak foot. That is actually what is actually very, very good on this card. The four-star skill, four-star weak foot is going to be very helpful so that he can do minimal dribbling and move into the space as well. Looking at the pace, the pace is fantastic. 90-90, not fantastic. Let me, let me, let me reel that back. It's very good. Decent, almost, at this stage of the game. You need to go ahead and max that out. If you're going to play with Casemiro at this stage of the game, I know that he's very, very good defensively and he will be able to jockey well enough, but that pace needs to be maxed the hell out. Uh, the shooting is insane on this card. 96 attack conditioning, 99 shot power, 85 finishing. That's very good for a CDM. Long shot of 99, so you can bury them from the midfield. Really, really don't push too high, but attempt those long shots, and, 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 and they're going to work very, very well. The passing on this card, 99 vision, 99 short pass, 99 long pass. That is also sensational. The dribbling on this card, he is unique body type. That 99 passing and 99 uh, uh, short pass and long pass with 99 vision, that's actually crazy. That is actually crazy. He is going to be able to distribute the ball to perfection. The dribbling, unique body type, 99 uh, agility and balance. That's sensational. 95 reaction. Everything is very well formatted for the dribbling you could go up ahead and apply an engine if you would like something that would be boost the pace boost the dribbling as well the passing really doesn't need anything but the engine would touch those two very important key stats the defending on this card there is nothing to say casemiro is going to be an absolute wall in your midfield which is very useful having somebody who you can rely on to intercept and cut the plays before it even gets to your defenders is very very useful especially at this current state of the game in fifa where every card is pretty much broken so you need a lot of uh, players who have defensive acumen who are able to defend um heading accuracy very good jumping very good he's going to be a threat in the box physicality at 95 uh at 96 95 stamina 96 strength and 97 aggression he's going to win those 1v1s to perfection dive into tackle is the really really big highlight we have to mention here that is fantastic he's team player he has the long shot takers as well which supports the 99 long shots now to complete this card you're going to have to assist using a la liga player in seven separate and seven separate wins so you'll have to play seven matches in total uh, i would suggest doing this in rival i cannot bear doing uh, squad battles at the trenches of the the game uh 
you have to score five goals using Brazilian players. So La Liga, make sure you have La Liga players and Brazilian players in your squad. This has to be in professional or rival. You have to score three outside the box goals. This has to be on professional or rival. And you have to assist four. You have to assist in four separate matches and minimum uh, professional or rivals. Boys, this card is sensational, really. Casimiro, there's nothing to say. He is going to be absolutely broken. He is going to move so well. He is also going to defend insanely well. He has to dive into tackle to support with these crazy, the crazy animation, the long shot, the insane passing, the insane defending, and the very good pace that you do need to max out. Drop a like on this video. Let me know if you will be completing Casemiro or if you just have another player that is as good as Casemiro. But I think he is a must. Drop a like, subscribe, and I'll catch you very soon for another video on the channel. Peace out, boys.